Man, the weather today is nothing short of spooky. <laughs> now I'm not scared anymore. <laughs> It feels like a proper fall day here in West Virginia and it's sort of yet to be seen what that's going to do to the track. Whether it's going to get more wet or dry off and burn out or I don't know. Should be interesting. Waking up. You're waking up, you're like, how are you again? No way. Yeah. Um, so the bike felt, felt really good yesterday, but I feel like there's something weird in my fork this morning. So I don't know if it's just me, maybe being tired or whatever. But it felt like so on all the chatter like bottom part where it's flat and you have rocks, it feels like I have good grip and I can like control it. Yeah. But as soon as there's like a like a rock drop or like coming to the new section you have like a comp compression type of thing i feel like it's either my, my back coming up on the front it's not it's i don't know if it's diving or it happened like a couple of times where I, I felt like i was thrown over the front and and then i added one low speed compression but i feel like i have like already a little bit yeah, Do you want to see the setting sure i just photographed it uh, thingy. You have a ton of compression. Yeah, I know. So maybe I should. Uh, but I'm like. So that's. I always do like camping. Yeah, but it'd be better to go up in pressure a yeah. little bit. Yeah, because now you see, like, here. Yeah. I'm like quite high up and like I haven't. Uh, but I, I think a lot of these events happen yeah, on like, the, the, the drops that. Yeah, but it didn't feel like this yesterday, right? Okay. That's what I mean. Like it's weird in a sense because it's the same track. Yeah. It's just on that one new section you come in and you like, and it's like I don't know if it's normal, but you feel that he's going the whole way down. Yeah. It did. I didn't feel like he was doing it. My bike is slow-ish. Yeah. But I like it like that. It's like more predictable in this like jumps that you overshoot and stuff. I'm, I'm happy in general, but I feel like maybe maybe I should try to hard, ride harder in the front or something, or like... Probably? I have two tokens, oh like spacer, not tokens, sorry. Okay, um, at what pressure right now? 64. I'm not like, this is like on only a few like bits, you know, like that, that rock drop to flat or like something like that. It's not... Yeah, I would open that compression up a little bit and, and yeah, raise pressure. pressure. Yeah, we can yeah. try that. Okay. Because like now I'm back into protection position. Yes. Just. So just, is good just, just I, I can like chill a bit more on quality day now. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, so. Um, I open this too. Yeah. So then just go up three PSI six, probably. Six, six, yeah. yeah. Okay. And give it a run. Yeah. Okay. You I'll don't think we should open more here then too? Because you're so used to running it at nine. Yeah. Two is a fair yeah. bit. Yeah, 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 yeah. Thank you. I'll find you in a bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, I think I'm just gonna go with the rest program. Okay. I just did two and I did everything I wanted. It's just like I think I, some of the bits I could maybe try to like improve the, the fork a little bit. Because you don't know what's gonna happen later today. You know? <laughs> we hope it. For once, I'll be hoping there's no rain. Thank you, Jordy. See ya. Um, I feel like I'm not using all my travel. Okay. Probably on back. Are front and back or? Both. Both, okay. I was landing hard off the, both the road gaps and it wasn't. And still not. And then in the rocks, I can, it was good right at the start and then now it's kind of feeling like I could go a bit softer and like kind of. Yeah. Okay. Of, um, we can try it. Yeah. Also, 
Keep in mind that maybe soft won't be the greatest for or, the flat stuff, like if you're trying to stay on top of things. Yeah. But obviously, like that'll be something you figure out. Yeah. Do you feel like the general balance is pretty good? Like you just want to soften up both ends a tiny bit? I think bit? so. Okay. Maybe a little bit more, like it's almost like a little bit back, but okay. like I wouldn't say it's slowing me down or throwing me off at all. Drop a couple PSI out of the fork, you think? Maybe a couple. Try it. Two, three, four, yeah. Cool. Give that a shot. Okay. Thanks, After sir. this, we can focus on the shock a little more. Yeah. But let's just see what it what it's like. Yeah. I'll have to be. I, I think my practice is done. But yeah. I'll do it after time training. Thank you, guys. Cool. See ya. Yeah, all good, mate. To be honest, cool. um, just. I wouldn't here. expect any changes if the track hasn't actually changed really. Nah, not really too much at all. Um, I still need. To, I'm still like losing time in the same yeah, bit consistently, like every time run. Pretty much, it's like, like between. Well, I don't know if the splits are the same, but between three and four. So it's like as it starts to flatten out and across yeah. the rocks at the bottom. Um, do you so, want to get a little more weight on the front end, or? Do you... I did that yesterday. Okay. Yeah. Did it help? So I dropped a bit of. Uh, I took two out of low speed compression on the fork just to. Just so I felt like the front was a bit not so like choppy left to right give yeah. me a bit more confidence to just plow through it and that was definitely better but i think i could go stiffer but what i was like, thinking overall. like you could firm it up but maybe even push the fork tubes too like through a little bit through. to get more weight on the front yeah yeah but not make it softer yeah yeah because like in the final i used all the travel like it yeah was up I here, so it. so it's not like it's too stiff how many more runs are you going to get Depends. Uh, I've done two. I don't want to do any more than like five. Really. Yeah, yeah, no, totally. Um, Why don't you so get maybe... you into drop to push the forks through like two mil? Yeah, yeah. And just see if it gets you a better feeling through the flat stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because it's just like I feel like I'm off the brakes and I want to carry speed, but it's just like getting hooked up. Because mm, that I feel like now I'm going faster, like. You know that section that is quite flat, rocky, until that harsh drop, yeah. like real near the end. It feels like the like the rear of the bike is just getting like packed, and then I'll, I'll get like a big kick. Okay. Because I knew we slowed the high speed rebound, but I don't know whether to put that back and try that now. Let's give it a shot. Maybe high speed compression too, because I'm not damaging wheels, and that's quite open. I think it was. Yeah, we could maybe put put that in a little bit. Let's give that a shot. Okay, nice. Opened it a little bit. On the low speed. On high rebound, opened it. Yeah. And yeah. then opened low compression one. One. Yeah. Okay. Not a whole lot. All right. Nice. Just see it. I'll try that. Right if that feels better, then. Then we'll go more. Yeah. Or maybe like try the high speed compression. Yeah. We'll see. But I'll try that first. Okay. Thanks, mate. I'll let you know. We really made very few changes, and there was nothing consistent. Some people are on the same setup they were in Lenzerheide, like Cam's on the same setup. Stoked, everything's good. Uh, other people are making small changes, but there's no like underlying theme like there was two weeks ago. How is the forecast looking? The last time I checked a few hours ago, it's like 50% chance of rain in the afternoons. 50 to 60. So if it rains, we're not going to see anybody. And I think if it doesn't rain, it's still going to be quiet because people have figured out. They've done what they're going to do. We've already had three practice days and a race day, so I doubt there's going to be any major changes. It's pretty impressive to see everyone just getting right back at it, going into practice right after having a race yesterday, but we are quickly closing in on the final race of the season, so we'll see you tomorrow for qualifiers. That was great, Jordy. Good job, Jordy. <laughs> I'm coming back. <laughs> Not doing chair flips today, that's for sure. Oh man. <laughs> Man, that vegan falafel plate lasted a long time. <laughs>
Wow. I haven't put my picture in yet, but I'm going to. So come ask me questions at your own risk.